613 now bringing an awareness to an issue that affects our older generation. Betsy Arnold, along with Jacob Arnold, with the Broyles Foundation, they're here to tell us about Drive and Dine for Dementia, the 2019 ver version. Guys, thank you for joining us this oh, morning. It's our Absolutely. pleasure. Thank All you. All right, uh, Betsy, you're a friend of the show. You've been on the show on uh, numerous occasions, but for our viewers uh, who are not aware of the Broyles Foundation, kind of tell uh, the folks what uh, services are provided through your organization. We're an Alzheimer's caregiving <coughs> foundation. We're boots on the ground working with caregivers day in and day out to help them understand the disease and how to care for it day in and day out. We provide coaching and counseling. Um, we lead three support groups a month. We're also a referral service. When they get to a point where they need transportation or they're looking for in-home care, then we help them guide. We, we guide them essentially through every aspect of the disease. And that's why this event, Drive and Dine for Dementia, is so important. Jacob, kind of tell us the importance of this event. Yeah, so, I mean, Alzheimer's and dementia can be a morose <laughs> topic, so we try to celebrate what it is that we do for local caregivers and caregivers all around the country. This, this event allows us to support those caregivers at absolutely no cost. My grandfather said a resource should never be a burden and we want to keep that going for forever. So we're, we're very proud of the event. And we're seeing uh video from uh, events in years past. It's uh, two days or two events in one day. Okay. So let's uh, kind of talk about what people can expect from this event. Yeah, absolutely. So we do two flights of golf at Paradise Valley. It's very competitive. The winners of that golf tournament are actually awarded at our dinner a custom go. Broyles Foundation green go. jacket. I like that. Yeah, like shout that. out to the good people at Walker Brothers Walker for taking Brothers. good care of us yeah, here. Absolutely. Um, so we go from the golf tournament right to the town yes. center. We have a green carpet. We have an wow. open bar all night. What? Chef Miles James cooks mm -hmm. a steak on site. Wow. We're yeah. the only event that prepares our food on site. We're wow. also very proud of that. We try to tie in some of the things that are from my grandfather's legacy and with the Broyles Award, so we bring in you know, coaching legends like Bobby Bowden and so guys like Florida State head coach. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. Mark mm -hmm. Hall of Famer. Mm -hmm. You know, and the ties that they have to my grandfather might not be, you know, very apparent. Right. But if you come to the event, you'll get to hear about, you know, how he impacted their lives as well. This has been an incredible turnout for the past few year years with this event, and I'm sure a lot of participation will take place. All right, uh, let's put up the information. Friday, July 12th. That's a special day close to me. That's there you go. His uh, birthday. Yeah, it's yeah. my birthday. Yeah. So looking forward to that. <laughs> Fayetteville Town Center, uh, as Jacob mentioned, you got a lot of events. You've got golf in the morning and then a silent auction, dinner and music in the evening. Tickets and registration still available, is that right? That's Absolutely. Correct. There you go. You'll find all the information you need to know about this event on our website later this morning. Jacob, Betsy, we appreciate it. And Thank as you. a tease, um, Betsy, she will be our mover and shaker tomorrow. Oh, so there gosh. you go. <laughs> yeah, so looking forward to putting that report together Thank tomorrow you. morning. All right, uh, time right now is 6.16. We'll be right back.